Hey guys, we're back with what is probably a no longer relevant case, the Apple Silicon case for the iPad Pro because third party knockoffs probably sell it for like three sixteenths of the price. Sixteenths. Six but for the 3% of you that like the real deal and well can afford it, let's check it out. The silicone case is made of, well, silicone, which does feel soft to touch and is a very grippy material, which you may need for such a big device, and has the identical finish to the smart keyboard and cover. The inside is lined with microfibers so your iPad can live the good life, and there's a cutout to not block cellular signal. Oh, and don't forget the embossed reminder that it was assembled, aka made in China. To install, stick the volume side in first, then simply squeeze the opposite corners in place. The volume buttons are covered and raised, which helps to find and are easy to press. A cutout for the mic, same situation for the power button, speaker grills along the top, and a cutout for the audio jack, which isn't too deep to interfere with most cables. Lightning cutout and speaker grills for the bottom set as well. Oh, and a camera cutout for the moms and aunts out there. Now, if you did sell a kidney and could afford the smart keyboard or cover, there's a cutout for that along the left edge too. But of course, we're not reviewing that today. Otherwise, it's a really simple case, meant for simple scratch protection and some much needed grip. The important thing is that it doesn't make using the iPad Pro suck. The grip does help with one-handed use and I'm more confident throwing my iPad on a table or in my bag without scratching it. All without adding too much bulk to the iPad, really only adding about 2 millimeters on. There is a generous lip around the screen which helps with laying it face down on flat surfaces and prevents sliding. It's not packed with a lot of absorbent material, so it's not going to be the best at drop protection. So don't buy this if you always drop your shit. Oh, and that lip is designed to work flawlessly with the edges of the smart keyboard and cover. It sits flush along each other, leaving no gap for anything to get in. And of course, it still slips in and out of bags easily, but won't help with you carrying it around in your pocket though. The downside, like any other Apple silicone case, is that it's a dust chick magnet. Everything it touches, it grabs some sort of dust, and it'll take about 23 and a half minutes to finally clean off. Using your hand is effective, but tiring. A microfiber cloth is just a waste of time, and this really doesn't help either. I'd recommend you take wrap pad out and use a damp cloth, but f***ing silicone, eh? It retails for 79 US and 99 Canadian. It comes in this charcoal gray that matches the black and the pure white that matches the uh, white and gold uh, iPads. It's quite an expensive case for what it is, so it's definitely not for anyone that's just looking for simple protection. You can get that for about 10 to $15 on eBay or Amazon. It's definitely for the diehard fans that love all things Apple, like myself, but I still can't even afford this, so. Anyways, that's it. If you liked my video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't give a thumbs down, and do subscribe for future updates. I rest my case.